What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. Once again, with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all luxury, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Tuesday, no, Monday, sorry, Monday, June 14th, and as I say each and every video, smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way, and if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general, make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. How to spell that will be down in the left hand, bo the bottom left hand corner of your screen. It's down below the video in a hashtag, and it's down in the description box below, so you guys can, you know, know how to spell it and stuff like that. It's also the name of the channel, so however you see it is how you spell it. Um, I hate when this uh thing pops up i don't know why i just feel like it's it irritates me <laughs> like sometimes i try to do it before the video but if you guys saw it popped up as soon as i started the video anyway <laughs> first things first let's get the madame nazar's location which is, if you've been looking at the map she's down here near bulger glade right below roads in scarlet meadows She's right here. She will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know, or not of America. How I get to her when she's in her, this location right here is I simply fast travel the roads. It should put you around this post office train station area right here. And when I spawn here, I just take the train track down, or you can simply take the train track down and when you see this little overpass right here, just go over and get to it like that. Me personally, I come over on this side of the, the train tracks and just run down because I know that she's right here. So I just head towards her area. But she's there and as I said, she will be there until 2 a.m. It's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone for those of you who don't know or not of America. I kind of got this video started maybe like 15 minutes later than I usually start because somebody was on the other side of my area, uh, of my house, using a weed whacker and I didn't want it in the video. But <laughs> that that has nothing to do with y'all. Anyway, I'm going to try to get these, these things over with quick so um, I got to get the video up because it's starting to take a little bit longer to um upload but anyway the next thing i want to get to is the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle the caribbean antique alcohol bottle is up here in coulter as you see where i am coulter is above uh big valley or grizzly west and it's up here in the snow if you want to get this caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle it's right here in this little city. So fast travel to Coulter. I don't know. Depending on your area, it may cost a lot or a little. But in this city, there's three things to look forward to that I can tell you guys real quick. There's a bunch of stuff up here. If you do come up here, look for the fossils or go click on my link and I should have a video for you guys so you can find the fossils. But a lot of the fossils are up here in the cold. There's also like a bird egg down in this area right here. Like uh, right about here, I think. Around in this area, maybe. Maybe down here a little bit. Like around this area. There's a bird egg. That bird egg is a hawk egg. But we're not up here for the hawk egg. We're up here to come to this little city. Right inside this shack right here, as soon as you walk through the door, to your left, you should see a cabinet, and inside that cabinet, you will see a Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle. 
Also, in the house to the room right next to the fireplace, right here, there's a family heirloom. That family heirloom is a rosewood hairbrush. I also have a tarot card that's over here inside this hall or whatever this is. It's on the table, and that's a seven of wands, so go get that as well. But remember, a lot of the fossils are up here in the snow, so dress warm and head up here and search for the fossils because the fossils do pay off a lot, to be honest. And I think today is the last day for Madame Nazar's 50% extra. So, I mean, if you're looking for the fossils, this, this is the way to be up here. Anywho, let's get down to where we normally handle business which is the Lemoyne area of the map. Try to zoom in as much as I can. The cycles for today, Monday, June 14th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Auxiliary Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Terror Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossil Cycle 4. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. A link to a video, well, the cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel, which is Hitman Miyagi YT. Uh, I'm going to quickly go over these things. I will not tell you exactly, like, I will not go in debt. Well, may, I might have to go in for this one because that's the antique alcohol bottle. It's on the second level. But I won't have to go too much in depth for these, so I'm going to tell you these really quickly. Uh, right up here, at our first marker, you guys will get a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is. But come over here with your metal detector right here at this location. It may be closer to the shoreline, maybe like right here. But come over here in this area, look for a tree stump or whatever, and that's what you will get, a fossil, a random fossil. Let's go to our next marker. There's a, before we get to that next marker, there's a coin over here somewhere. I think here. Right here next to this. Yeah, right here at this location, there's a coin. I could not tell you guys which one you would get, but come over here with your metal detector as well. And that's what you will get. Uh, let's go down to our next marker, which is a arrowhead. You need a metal detector for this one. It's right next to the tree that's over here in this area. So come around the base of that tree with your metal detector and that's what you will get, a random arrowhead. There's a goat hairbrush, which is a family heirloom right here at this location. It's sitting on a bench right at the back of this L-shaped shack. So go grab that. Uh, let's go over here to the left a little bit where this first marker right here, there's two things actually. Inside this shack, there's a antique alcohol bottle. As soon as you walk to the door to your right, there's a Scotch whiskey antique alcohol bottle. And there's if you go up a little bit and on that same side of the sh of the shack on the table with all the candles and stuff, you will see a King of Swords tarot card as well. Over here, well. After you go get grab those two, come over here to our next marker, which is another fossil. This fossil is randomized as well. I cannot tell you what it is, but come over here. I think it may be like by a tree. It's closer to the water. So I think it's like right here, maybe. Right there. Come over here with your metal detector and you will get led to the fossil that's right here in this area. Let's go over, let's go right here to our next marker. Right here at this location, you guys will find a Egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. It's in the tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Sometimes these bird eggs are not in the tree and either switch lobbies or look on the ground. Remember to use your eagle eye because somebody probably already came through and shot it down so you gotta look on the ground use your eagle eye you gotta you know, play the game smart um right here at this next marker you guys will get 
a random coin. I cannot tell you what it is, but come over here with your metal detector. Buy this little small broken broken down cart, I think. Yeah, it's like a small cart. Right here, like a small cart or, or small wagon. Right here in this location. At this location, with your metal, come over here with your metal detector, and that's what you will get a random coin. Um, let's go. We're gonna jump all the way over here and come back right here. But let's go to the cemetery real quick. Right inside this crypt right here, go through the gate and towards the back where there's a little stone shelf. And on that stone shelf, you guys will get a Benet's Topaz ring. B-A-N-A-I-S. That is a lost jury. This lost jury, it just has such a collection. I can't tell you much else about it. Anywho, but grab that and uh, come over here to this location right here. Right next to the fire that's over here. If you guys want to grab it, this is a tarot card. This tarot card is a two of swords. There's also a tarot card here. I cannot remember exactly what it is currently, but there's a tarot card there as well. I think it's sitting like on some boxes or crates or something right there at that location. And right here at this next marker, there's another tarot card. This tarot card is a four of cups. This four of cups is sitting on a box near a fountain with a light. So like right here where my marker is, this is where the fountain with a light is. And this is where the tarot card is that you're looking for. All right, let's go across the way to our next marker. How you get this is you have to get up on the second level. There's a ladder here. Go up the ladder, go across the, the walkway, jump across the railing again here. That should give you on this little walkway. Go across this walkway, jump across the railing again here. And then follow that path down and around to the antique alcohol bottle, which is sitting on the ground on the floor in like the crack of a door. So you can't go through the door or anything, but it's sitting right there. Let's go over to our next marker, which is right around the corner again, right here in this little area. If you guys see this little small little area right here, like right here at this location, it's like a little gate, go through the gate and there's a table on that table. You should see a family heirloom, which is a ivory hairpin. This ivory hairpin is ivory, ivory hairpin, adds it to the collection. <laughs> Let's go to our next marker which is another family heirloom. This family heirloom is sitting right here at this location. It's kind of out in the open, but it's kind of in this backyard. So it's in this backyard on a white outside furniture table. You know them easily to break tables, but it's right here on the table in the backyard. And that is a cherry wood comb if I did not say it. Um, let's go down to our next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns in this area each and every day. And as I say, it helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are, are on, which today it is cycle five. Um, there was something else I want to tell you guys about. Um, there's a couple things down here inside this shack if you want to come down here. There's a King of Cups tarot card on a cupboard behind the sofa. And there's a third born third burn. This one always gets to me. It's a third Thor burn turquoise ring inside the wardrobe in the first room to the right. So go grab that as well. Um, up here inside the Braithwaite Manor, there's two things. One is a family heirloom. The family heirloom is upstairs at the first room to the left. There is on the second floor, first room to the left, on the fireplace. There's a jade hairpin family heirloom, so go grab that. And the other thing is on the ground floor, is on the dinner table. This is a London Dry Jam bottle, so grab, go grab that as well. I have a couple things inside of rows, which is basically 
a couple tarot cards in right here there's a lost jewelry if you guys want to grab that right here next to the big pile of rocks come over here with your metal detector and you will get a random lost jewelry uh right here at this location right next to the sheriff station or sheriff building or whatever you want to call it there's a tarot card this tarot card is a six of cups and right around the way right here inside this little room at this house there's like a, a room next to the house you cannot get into the house but you can get into this little room there's a little work table on that work table you guys will get a nine of pinnacles um the next thing i want to tell you about is up here near matic pond there's a house right here I mean, there's like a lot of like a lot of cows and stuff like this like a farmhouse or whatever but right here inside this house you guys will get a new guinea rosewood hairbrush it's in a chest in this bedroom so go grab that uh that's pretty much it for all the little extras that i have for you guys i'm gonna try to put this back a little bit close as possible so you guys can see all the stuff Remember to pay attention to the line and stuff in the videos if I did not say that because it helps indicate exactly where things are. Uh, the cycles for today, it's Monday, June 14th, are once again Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Luxury Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossil Cycle 4. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Luxury Cycle 4, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 5, and Fossils cycle four thank you guys for watching liking sharing commenting i do appreciate each and every bit of it because any type of interaction with my channel helps the channel out you know what i'm saying it helps it grow and helps it build and helps people be able to view and see my channel so you know they can get the information or you know subscribe and all the other stuff so i do appreciate you guys and if you haven't yet Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. The last couple of days I've been doing live streams and stuff, so make sure you guys um, join in and talk to me or something like that. Uh, you may even, if you play GTA, I may even do like free car giveaways because I have most of the cars and stuff like that. So make sure you guys you know tune into that type of stuff i may i've been thinking about doing like car giveaways if you guys are into gta um i don't know if i can do anything with um rdr i don't know if there's any type of giveaways or anything i could do with rdr but if i could i would um you know but join in and talk to me <laughs> Let me know. Give me some good ideas for games to play and stuff like that. Anywho, it's your baby right here, man, and I'm talking a little bit too much. I got to get this video up. Thank you guys for watching, and I'm out.